Okay, let's start the second problem of this chapter number 7. The problem is give the number of bytes stored in the memories listed in problem number 7.1. Okay, we have to see the problem number 7.1 for the memory units. There are 6 memory units. So from this we have to find out the number of bytes. So previously we have this problem 7.1. Here we have seen that the memory units that follows are specified by the number of words. These are the number of words times the number of bits per word so this is the number of bits per word that means if we multiply these two numbers we will get the number of bits so we have to consider one by one each of them and we have to find out the number of bytes we know that one byte is equal to eight bit now we will consider each one of these memory units and we will find out the number of bytes okay so now let us consider one by one so in a we have 8k into 16 so this one we can write it as 8 into 2 to the power 10 into this is 2 into 8 okay so here we can write it is 2 cube 2 cube into 2 to the power 10 into 2 to the power 1 into 8 okay so we can write it as 2 to the power 14 into 8 so this is nothing but this is 8 bit okay 8 bit into this much that means this much of byte therefore number of bytes suppose we denote with capital b so we'll have 2 to the power 14 so this 2 to the power 14 means 1 6 3 8 4 bytes so this is the solution of the first part of the problem in the second part we have 2z into 8 okay here we need not to factorize this 8 because in the previous case you can see that this 8 is nothing but it is one byte okay so one byte into this much so it will be this much of byte so here we have already 8 so let us find out 2 to the power 1 into z means 2 to the power 30 into 8 so 2 to the power 31 into 8 therefore b is equal to 2 to the power 31 equal to 21474836484 so this much of bytes in the third part we have 16m into 32 16 means 2 to the power 4 m means 2 to the power 20 into this 32 means 2 square into 8 that means this is 4 4 into 8 this is 32 so here we have 2 to the power 4 plus 20 plus 2 that is 26 into 8 therefore b is equal to this is 2 to the power 26 so if we expand this we will have 6 7 1 0 8 8 6 4 so this much of bytes now let us go to our fourth part of the problem in the fourth part we will have 256k into 64 so here we will have this 256 means 2 to the power 8 into k means 2 to the power 10 into 64 64 means 8 into 8 okay 1 8 will be 2 cube into 8 okay so here we will have 2 to the power this is 18 plus 3 21 21 into 8 okay this number of bits okay therefore bytes is equal to number of bytes is equal to 2 to the power 21 is equal to 2097152 bytes okay next we have part e in e we have 64k into 8 so 64 means 2 to the power 6 into k means 2 to the power 10 into 8 so this much of bits will have so 2 to the power 16 into 8 number of bits now if we find number of bytes so we have to divide by 8 okay so we'll have 2 to the power 16 therefore b is equal to 2 to the power 16 is equal to 65536 okay this number of bytes next we have the last part of the problem in f we have 2t capital t into 8 so here we have 2 to the power 1 into 2 to the power 40 
into 8. Here we have 2 to the power 41 into 8. Okay, this much of bits. Now if we divide by 8, we'll have the number of bytes. Therefore, b is equal to 2 to the power 41. So 2 to the power 41, if we expand, we'll have 2.1990232. Two five six into ten to the power twelve number of bytes. So this much of bytes in this memory unit. Okay. So this is the solution of the problem number seven point two. If you have any question, please put it in the comment section below. Also like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.